Hi. So, basically, I. Shut up, Lester. I bought the 190Z, the the Karin or, or the Karin 190Z, and basically, uh, I, I customized it in the shop. I talked about a lot of things. There are actually some things in the beginning of the video that I talked about that were important. I'll repeat them. I was done customizing it. I was driving it around and testing it to give it a proper review. And and guess what? Guess what? J just take a wild guess. My PS4 decides to shut down on me. It it, it just turns off. It, it just it just turns off. And this happens kind of often. This kind of often, and so basically, I just wasted like probably a half an hour or less of me talking about you know this car and other things. And I, I don't think I can even call this a customization video. It it's just a review now. But yeah, I'm kind of uh, mad about that. But. Anyways, I guess I'll talk about the other things now. So, I haven't been uploading that much lately. I just kind of lost interest in making videos. Uh, not a lot of people watch my videos anyway. I, it only gets, like, up to five views. Or, five views if I'm lucky. At most, like, it's like three views. But, also, I've been moving, which has been kind of stressful, but it's done now. I also started college, which has me pretty busy, and just making videos consumes more time than I like. For the magic touch? So, since I already customized this car, I guess I'll just explain quickly. Uh, I wanted to make it look like some parts of it were missing, and there's 23 customization options. Alright, alright. I wanted to make it look like parts were missing, so I removed the hood. Uh, this is kind of a weird car. It's a, I think it's a good addition to the Sports Classics class. Although, it is pretty slow compared to the higher cars, or the better cars. But just because it's slow doesn't necessarily mean it's a bad thing. It's just out of the league of the top few cars. Which are more like super classics than any th anything else. Excuse me, I've been drinking Barks root beer. An NPC just said my car was great. Yay. But yeah, this is a uh, this is a weird car in the way it looks and the way it drives. So I wanted to make it look out of the ordinary too. So, look, look, we have vents on the side, we have the hood off, there's chrome mirrors. I don't really like working with the color red, so I didn't really choose a secondary color for this one. I noticed that this car has sticker bombs on it, and I thought about adding sticker bombs on it, but I know that they're ugly, but I I'm kind of okay with that, but especially with the red, it lo just looks pretty bad. Uh, I put some sticker bombs on my ASEA, or ASEA, but I think I removed them sometimes. Uh, I better finish this quickly before, you know, my PS4 decides to randomly shut off again. Oh, voice crack. No, stop. Uh, not, unfortunately there were no liveries that made the car look rusted or damaged in some way, so I just chose, uh, it's lower. That's the name of the livery. I also like there's there's new wheel customization, so I took advantage of that. Uh, I think yellow and red go kind of good together, but it reminds me of McDonald's. So, and I could have made this a McDonald's mobile if I wanted to, but I just didn't. I just made it a uh, it's kind of a mess of a car, at least in the front. Look at this. The snout is kind of hollow in the front part. Like, you can see the bottom, like, on the ground. You can see this right through it. 
this that many parts of this now is removed but we have the we have a chrome grill and a and a chrome headlights or no uh, chrome mirrors I meant sorry chrome mirrors and uh, there's vents on the hood and the side is like open in a rectangular shape for the exhaust to stick out well they aren't sticking out that much but anyways the top speed isn't that good but it's it's kind of okay for a car to be slow I mean we have the dynasty and it's not really meant to be a race car it's just you know meant for cruising this car kind of the way this car is shaped it reminds me of a boat so yeah there you go uh, the the braking is pretty uh, average the customization is great though so I guess I'll give this car like a B plus or something Excuse me, I've been drinking Barks root beer.